Spence will no doubt appear the bigger fighter face to face. And for this fight, Mikey Garcia will move up two weight classes from 135 pounds at lightweight to Spence's welterweight division at 147 pounds. As such, Team Garcia's camp will include a focus on building up strength and muscle. So, so let the band pull you. Sit back on. My role is to get him ready to go up in weight and be prepared for the things that Errol Spence is going to bring and to bring out the best in Mike as far as the skills that he already possessed. Right there, hunt. There you go. Stay in that hunting position. We're moving up in weight, so we got to be able to hold our own. But we don't want to lose the speed. We don't want to lose our explosiveness. And Daryl understands what a boxer needs, what I need. He knows me. He's worked with me in the past. There you go. Make him mean something. We got the fight, but now we got to get in shape for this type of fight. And that's why we're including this type of training. That's why we're pushing myself to these extremes. But everything complements my boxing style and what I'm going to do on fight night. We're going to be fast. We're going to be explosive. We're going to be sharp. But we're also going to be a little stronger. There's a lot of muscle that people think that he's going to need to carry it to this weight, but not so. The most important part is converting that muscle into active strength and power and speed. As your muscles get bigger, we have to get the tendons ready to respond to the bigger muscle. So the active explosive movement converts to speed and power. Everything quick and fast. There you go. I want to use my speed, I want to use my intelligence, my footwork to overcome the size advantage that Errol has. Put this contrast in there while you're tired. Control your body. All right, let's pause right there. Um, you can watch this. I found it. If you have on demand right now, I don't even know what today's date is. Oh, it's the second. March the 2nd, 28, 2019. 525 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I got Comcast Xfinity. It's on demand. It's under, um, um, all you got to do is go to, um, under boxing or go to Fox Sports. On demand. And you'll see they have all the content. They have the face-to-face. -face. You don't have to go to the Fox Sports Go app. They literally have all the content on there. I was, I was shocked, especially for um, Mikey Garcia versus um, Errol Spence. Anyway, I'm T Street Controversy. This is T Street Controversy Live. This right here is the first episode of um, Fight Camp. It's Fox Sports version. I hate using the term, but their version of HBO 24-7 or All Access. And obviously, it's a little more watered down because it's for free TV. But there are four parts. In fact, let me go, let me see. Let me look it up for you and tell you the exact dates. I know tomorrow's episode, episode number two, comes on tomorrow night on um, Fox Sports, if I'm correct. Let me check just to be sure. For the time, I know it is tomorrow night. I don't know the time, though. No. Let me check to be sure. So they have a sneak peek of part two. Here, before we, let's watch part two first before we go anywhere before we talk about anything else. We are pushing the, the training, peaking right where we're supposed to be. We're right on schedule. I feel really good. I'm excited and, and it's just around the corner. Two of them. Three of them. No slowing down to the fight week. It's nice to spend some time with the kids. Are you gonna be a boxer? Yes! And my mom and dad always just told me that you wanna do it, you're gonna do it. You do it to your fullest. Everything that he said is coming true. So he always said, I'm going to be at the Cowboys Stadium. Mama Spence. Walking in right now, you know, and I'm seeing all the billboards. It's like, wow, this is, this is really happening. It's pretty damn cool. It's amazing to have two of you, the talent you got, go against each other. So that's a preview for tomorrow's, oh shit. That's a preview for tomorrow's night episode right here. So to go back to what I was reading, let's see. Damn it, where's it at? So there's four parts. Let's see, so... PBC Fight Camp Errol Spence versus Mikey Garcia on Sunday, March the 3rd, 1.30 p.m. Eastern, immediately followed by the premiere of the one-hour Fox Sports PBC Countdown Errol Spence versus Mikey Garcia. Wow, that's a lot of uh, content here. I'll show y'all. So we're going to cover both of these. So tomorrow, there's going to be the um, the second episode of Fight Camp. And then immediately followed by the premiere of the one-hour episode of Countdown, Mikey Garcia versus Errol Spence. Hmm. So let's look at the dates for... Um, where are the dates at? Okay, episode three airs Sunday, March the 10th at 1.30. Then on Saturday, March 16th at 9 p.m. 
So I'm guessing the last episode is going to air. Episode four is going to air after the fight, kind of like um, um, the um, Showtime All Access epilogue. So, you know, we've pretty much already, like, talked about everything of importance with Mikey Garcia and um, Errol Spence. You know, it's the wait. You know, will the, like, will he, will he, will he be able to do to keep Errol Spence off of him? And once again, I got to say, man, he's got real, real big, those balls are big. He's got really big balls in that, in that Mexican scrotum. You know, because he literally forced Errol Spence into this fight. Errol Spence don't want this fight. He don't get no stripes from this fight. Yeah, he wants the payday. You can tell he don't get he not going to get no stripes. He should not move up, in my personal opinion. He should not move up in the pound for pound rankings for a win over Mikey Garcia. This is just a paycheck for him. I'm not, you know, clowning him for it. Unlike, you know, certain people won't be clowning him. If it was another fight, fight if it was another fighter fighting a smaller fighter, then it would be clowning. But whatever, man. I understand the business of it, you know, in AT AT&T Stadium. You know, you got motherfucking Jerry Jones. You got all of this promotion, all of this digital content. And if I'm correct, isn't this Fox's Fox had pay-per-views in the past? Let me see. Have Fox had pay-per-views in the past? They got to do this shit right. You know, new pay-per-view under a new deal. They got to do this shit right. It's their first pay-per-view. I'm really interested to see what the presentation is going to look like. And a part of me wants to buy it through fox sports but i don't want to take that chance fuck that we're going through xfinity <laughs> you know a part of me wants let's see what happens when you go click order sign in with facebook sure why not let's see what happens oh man no nah, no nah. see they want me no nah, i'm not doing that right now fox no nah, i'm not creating no profile that's it that's it i'm sick of you so um you know how the first episode of these things work if you haven't seen any, the, these mini docudrama buildups to the fight. The first episode is always focused on, you know, introducing you to the fighters. You know, Errol Spence, his family, you know, um, what, is he, what he does on his free time. And interesting enough, I posted it. In fact, let me go to my Twitter so I can, I can be able to show you Pep better. Remember, we've heard that he's lost Errol Spence to Brian Castano, who's fighting Errol's Lindy Laura tonight on Showtime in the Amateurs. And we know he lost to Omar Figueroa in the amateurs. But is this the reason why? Was he up playing Madden all night? Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Did I take it down? Did somebody, did Showtime take it down? Oh, here it is. I mean, Fox? So pay attention to this. Come on, bro. You got to stay on it, man. And he probably, man, he missed this flight during this episode. So I wonder if also he was playing Madden all night. I so listen. Who was it? Is that why you missed your flight, Earl? Who was it you lost to? That's some real little, little nice piece of information right there. But once again, I'm going to be here tomorrow night um, covering all of, you know, in fact, I'm going to put this information from this press release right down below in the description box so you can read it for yourself so you can have an um, understanding of the schedule of what the content is going to be because now the fight is what um 15 days away 14 days away two weeks away a saturday is two weeks away in t street controversy this is t street controversy live with fightview360.com um i'm going to give fight camp episode one i'm going to give it a nine i guess I'm trying to figure out why I can't give it a 10. I can give it a 10 because, you know, I, I didn't really see any flaws in it. Please subscribe. Teach Your Controversy. This is Teach Your Controversy Live.